Oh man, feels like it's been forever. Back to church, here we go. Wait, what? Let's try this one. Come on. Okay, this ought to do it. What? Maybe this one. Hello? Anybody home? Aha! Uh -huh. Pallister suit, how do you get into this place? I didn't even know this door existed. Maybe... Phase two, come on! Okay, last shot, here we go. Oh, this is just not happening. Is your sanctuary open? Unfortunately, here at McIver Church, our church building is still closed in this season. But does that mean that we as a church are shut down? It was some 50 years ago that one pastor, A.W. Tozer, penned these words. If you burn down the church building and drive away all the people, you have not disturbed Christian worship at all. Keep a Christian from entering the church sanctuary and you have not in the least bit hindered that person's worship. We carry our sanctuary with us. We never leave it. And this sounds pretty similar to what Paul wrote in 1 Corinthians chapter 3. He says, you are God's building. Don't you realize that all of you together are the temple of God and that the Spirit of God lives in you? The Spirit of God lives in you. The Spirit of God lives in us. This is not to diminish a sense of location or of sacred space, but just to say that here in this season, we have not become separated or distanced from God's presence. No, even in the midst of great disruption that's taken place, the one thing has not changed, and that is the essential work of the Holy Spirit in us. The Spirit is always present to us no matter where we are, desiring to show His presence and to fill our lives. This Sunday is an event we call Pentecost, where Christians celebrate the gift of the Holy Spirit, the Counselor who is the power and the presence and the very wisdom of God available in our lives. At McIver Church, we're beginning a new series called Holy Spirituality where we will explore this powerful work that the Holy Spirit does in our lives. And we want you to experience this in your own life, and so we invite you to join us for our online service that premieres on our YouTube channel each Sunday at 10 a.m. In this season, no matter the geographical or emotional space that you are in, the Holy Spirit wants access to move in and to inhabit your life, to bring this full presence and power of God. And so I'll ask you one more time, is your sanctuary open?